My wife is richer than all my enemies. This is coming from Nigerian celebrity barman Kubana Chief Priest. According to Gist Making Rounds, the barman unfollowed Big Brother Niger winner Messi AK, um, Messi AK <laughs> and removed all traces of her endorsement deals from his page after Messi failed to heed to the agreement to stay in Uwewe because she had another event. This made fans of uh, Messi true Kubana Chief Priest and the post about his wife being richer than his enemies has been interpreted to being a response to Messi fans so mm. ewa mm? <laughs> <laughs> okay yeah, like you said a lot mm. of gist like different version and different stories mm -hmm. because i read one saying that um it was because she has a new management now and the mm. management um a management is telling him that if you want her to keep appearing in all your clubs and all you have to pay mm. and i think they said um is 1.5 you were supposed to pay 1.5 million or so mm -hmm. and it was it went on bragging about how he helped her in the house i was one of those people that supported that to another jaroma just forgot <laughs> you know mm -hmm. i was one of those people that supported her to win the big brother house but management is like business is business she can't keep doing free she's already a brand now that's why i read i mean and I just feel like most of these celebrities, is it that they support people just so when they come out, you can control their life and use them? If, you're, if you love her and you're supporting her as your weary sister, just do it with her. I know that you want her to come out of the house and start being a yes, yes, yes boss to you. It, it can't work that way. Especially, she's not just on her own. She has other people that she's working with, that they have um, aim and objectives. And if she's working with other people, you have to respect that and respect what... They, the only thing she can do is that, okay, maybe, oh, Kubana is my person. I can give him a discount or something. I mean, I, other ways, not that you just think you can call her any day, any time, and you want her to say yes to you. Um, so, on this one, I think... Um the issue all started with the whole Moet and Chandon um, endorsements, which wasn't actually real because she didn't have that. It was just a fiasco endorsement that she, because she didn't really have that endorsement deal. Now, it, with the actual brand, it was with Kubana. And it was just you, you're doing this to promote. Um, no, his own club. Mm. And it's not even like it's his club, it's his boss's club. It was using that to promote his club. And um, I think she was in a worry. And then she came with him, and then they, that was when our, our team realized that they could not actually see um, the BS from a mile away, and they knew that, oh, so this guy is not, he has been giving us fake endorsement deals, fake this, fake that, you know, dropping, paying for hotel bills. So, but come on, man, this girl has to feed too, you understand? You can't just be putting me in a hotel, making sure I'm good, making sure I'm riding a Rolls Royce, making sure, and then I'm not getting any money in my pocket, not audio. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's all your money. Mm -hmm. So and maybe they didn't want that anymore and they started asking that, okay, look, for appearance, because it was, she was supposed to appear at his restaurant as well, mm -hmm. where he said she would be doing a meet and greet. And she got endorsed by another, um, what's it called? One of taxi these brand. taxi mm -hmm. rides and all that. Mm -hmm. A few days before that. So she had to go attend to that. But it was like, no, you're supposed to wait for this. But if she's going to make more money from that and she's been endorsed by that team, I think it's only right for you to understand yeah, it might have been sad that it clashed with what you had planned, but then pay for that. And I don't even think, no matter the money you're paying right now, because you didn't endorse her, it's not like she had any legal agreement with so you. So what was that uh, paper signing arrangement? It was all a fiasco. It wasn't no, I, yeah, I, I, I read that it was after she changed management, then the management went brought, through um, the papers. Yeah, mm -hmm. brought a lawyer to go through the paper. Even the company the denied the, the, the champagne brand like, denied that. So she did not read it? Does Messi sound like? Sorry. Okay. <laughs> See, things like this just, um, I, I don't know. You know, they say when the celebrity thing just comes on you, like it just happens. Even when, actually, when you're not prepared for it, you're bound to mm. make so much mistake. I don't think anybody will bring any paper to you right now and you'll read it. Even if you decide to sign it, it's you that have decided, okay. I think and I can. We even call the company. You know, but <laughs> yeah, I, you I, have I don't. Give me their aside having a lawyer, there are things that it's just commonsensical. You mm. should know, right? And I just, I just hope that they are able to settle this. I, I like the whole <coughs> sisterly and brotherly thing they were doing, yeah. and I hope this also doesn't affect the relationship she has with um, the other, the people she 
is, I think she, well, I don't know if she bought the house or it's another fiasco of, you know, they're all the in this, five bedroom duplex. you know, they're all in this team together and I really hope that they can settle mm -hmm. it because um, you cannot keep using her personality and her brand and think that because you voted her in the house mm -hmm. that she owes you, that maybe she owes everybody on this day. Mm -hmm. Well, I didn't vote for her. Let's just be I didn't vote for her. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but um, I was going to say that I wouldn't want us to like reach a conclusion on this because it's just rumors going around. Yeah. Messi has not said anything. Kubana Chief Priest has not said no, anything. No, he has Kubana done something. He said that. Said, he, said, yeah, he said he's page. going. Um, he wants an uh, interview yeah, with, with Dotson. Mm -hmm. Dot mm -hmm. So maybe after the interview. So let's see. Well, I'm not sure that interview I'm is sure going that to happen. Jump on this as well. Because, mm -hmm. except that phrase, because I saw Dotson responded to that post saying that um, he's, he's starting, a new, he's starting a new show. So I think probably the management of where he works are trying to. Um, mind the kind of things they are mm. always associated with. So it's not look like when there's a fight, it's always this platform that we go to to set, you know. Uh, so I, I don't know what's going to happen. To Daddy Freeze, Daddy Freeze don't mind. It will Please. jump on No, it. Daddy Freeze to... already has a platform. You know Daddy Freeze and Dotto works in the same place, right? Mm. So Daddy Freeze already has a platform separate from yeah. that platform. No, no, that's so what we're, we're talking it. about Daddy Freeze yeah. platform right now. Like, yeah, that's, it I'm would, sure it will it jump Well, we would love to know this gist and drink tea over it. So we want to hear what say. If he wants to talk let him talk in fact come on tea time come on spill tea yeah we'll give you a spot for cheap i'm from abia state so we are not far so maybe you want to come <laughs> talk to me <laughs> so maybe you can come and talk to me <laughs>